Grandmother. Oh, shit. Okay. Grandmother fucking rising, everybody. It's your Uncle 79, the spiritual savage, here to bring you um, some morning message. You feel me? Uh, make sure you like, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell, select the all options so that you know when all my uploads upload. You feel me? Tap in. Let's get some thanks to the Most High God for bringing us here for this message, uh, for waking us up this morning. I don't know. I'm kind of wondering what's going on with the view here. We'll see. <laughs> there goes that smile. Okay, because I was I woke up this morning, um, and uh, got some heaviness here. Damn! Look, right at the. I was gonna grab the flashcards. Somebody said this morning. Let's see if we can mix it up here. Because there's some, uh, but thank you most I got for bringing us here. I'm going to get just jump right into this message. You know, I love you guys. Thank you for the likes, the shares, the comments, the subscribes. I truly appreciate you all. Also, um, thank you for any uh, donations made to my channel. Uh, thank you for booking the personal readings with me. Um, yeah. But there's, um, you know, there's some, there's some, it's some energy going on around that I felt when I woke up this morning. Now, not gonna lie, um, it was grief. I'm picking up on some heavy grief energy, okay? Let's see if we can, you know how people be, you know, one of those, um, there's a saying that people use a lot and, I, and, I, and I'm on the fence, well not on the fence about it, um, it's, you know, when people say, got me feeling some kind of way, I always go, well, what, what's that kind of way? I mean, to feeling some kind of way. Hey, I just got out the shower, y'all. I got a little conditioner in my hair, leave in and shit. <laughs> but somebody's feeling some kind of way this morning. Some people, I, I just heard people, I could be feeling some kind of way, but we're going to see what kind of way it is. I'm kind of on the fence about it because when people go, you made me feel some kind of way. Well, what kind of way was it? Was it a good way? Was it a bad way? Generally speaking, it's a bad way. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, I met people who made me feel some kind of way in a good way. You know, I just probably couldn't explain it. You know? Well, let's see. What's the feeling? What's the, what's the overall energy for this uh, message here? Well, I felt grief this morning, but well, excited. It did come out in the reverse, though, when I flipped it down. And then look what's there again. Sad. So some people are not... Some people are sad as fuck this morning. And with the excited and sad, excited in the reverse and scared. Ooh, look at that. Look at that face. Look at that. Look at that face on the baby. Look at the face. Oh, what does that mean? What the matter with the baby? <laughs> That's not funny. It could be. But I'm picking up on the fact that some people were excited. Okay, this is that this is that energy of party like, you know, celebrated too early. So I'm feeling like people were like this. Yay. And then they, and then it went to yay. No, you know what I'm saying? Uh, but now people are scared. And now listen. And angry. This is bored. But this is also side eye. You know, that's that's giving me side eye. So there's some people this morning. Uh, some that these people could be getting the side eye or people are bored with these people uh, Somebody's fucking angry and I mean pissed, okay? So th There's a multitude of different feelings, but I did feel grief this morning and when I say I felt grief I felt grief as if when I when I rolled over rolled over Somebody could have rolled over on some people too rolled over Alexa what does the term rolled over mean? Rolled over is a verb that describes the act of making a rolling motion or turning. It can also refer to the action of causing a rolling motion or turn. Additionally, rolled over can signify when a company gives in to demands or when a financial security is reinvested in the same or similar investment. Thank you. You are so very welcome. Happy Wednesday. Yeah. Hump day. I got on my 
Anybody recognize this fella? Yeah, Ice Cube. Okay, so this is, I, I picked this shirt this morning because I need to do laundry. <laughs> but, <laughs> no, I got this shirt the other day though because uh, when we talk about Ice Cube, okay, we got NWA. Does anybody remember BWP? We had NWA, niggas with attitudes, and then you got BWP, bitches with problems, okay? So that could be very significant this morning. California could be very significant as well. Uh, but Ice Cube out of the NWA, um, it's very interesting to watch his transformation. You know, he had it, Ice Cube was out of all of them was the most conscious one. Let's just say it. He had a, a, a multitude of awakenings during during his time with this group. You know, he was the you know first he was the thug, came out with the gangster rap. Then he was like the Muslim. You know what I'm saying? Remember when Ice Cube kind of went Muslim on you? on us and not to say that he's still not i mean i don't know but you know ice cube was very conscious he's and even now though you know i love watching uh, the videos that he posts ice cube ain't with the bullshit you know he's exposing these these phonies and frauds too in this in in the industry um so i i, I you know he's a he's a fellow gemini as well june 15th That date could also be very significant, but Ice Cube, thank you, Ice Cube, for all that you do for the collective. Um, they they they've been attacking him too. Um, confirmation, I feel like, but you know that that is the that that is the sound that says that that thing is powering down. I feel like Ice Cube shut shit the fuck down. Ain't nobody fucking with O'Shea like that. You know, anytime. Um, he just you know the thing the thing about Ice Cube that I that I that I'm you know, understand about him is that he's just, you know, he creates, he creates his own, he created his own lane as far as movies and music, music and movies are concerned. You know, Ice Cube's not folding, you know, he's not going to be doing dumb shit. That's the way I feel about Ice Cube, you know, but we knocked at the door, the book of the doors, divination deck. Let's see what I was picking up on some ancient Egyptian energy or whatever. But thank you for joining me this morning. It feels heavy, don't it, y'all? If something is this heavy. The Matrix is heavy, though, ain't it? Yeah. What is that sound? It feels like somebody's fucking underneath, like, un un in the ceiling. There could be something. Un okay, there we go. There could be something. I've been hearing it all morning. At first I thought it was the outlet. Like, you know how outlet would pop if there's something wrong with it? But no, there's probably something underneath the, within the, the structure. The cats aren't too alarmed about it. I guess I shouldn't be either. Can I get some uh, energy please for this message this morning? new i'll be right back i'm gonna look it up in the book all right so we got uh tepi al un from the house of tepi al un we have new number one okay the far the beginning and the end the beginning of a potent transformation with far-reaching possibilities okay this card fell out in the reverse okay one in the tarot deck is the magician backfire the beginning and the end so it's the end of the beginning a beginning of the end or in a reverse the beginning and the end new is the number one the first impulse of creation something is coming to an end this is the beginning of the end hmm there's the beginning of the end for something or someone or some people the beginning of a potent transformation with far-reaching possibilities. This is an ending. A backfire. Magic backfire, possibly. Uh, or some type of manifestation that's causing an ending. The beginning of a potent transformation. I keep, That's stuck in my head. The beginning of a potent transformation. What's the, what's the opposite? Uh, Alexa, what's the opposite of transformation? 
The opposite of transformation is stagnation, sameness, or preservation. Thank you. My pleasure. Just doing my job. Happy Wednesday. Stagnation stopped. Something's been, I'm telling you, something's been st reversed. Because to, to transform means to progress. But something's been sent back. Something's regressed. With far reaching pots up, like something's been cut off. Let's see what it is. All right, so something's been stopped. I'm hearing for all these energies. There's, there's something's been stopped. It's been sent back. Consider it a backfire, a return to sender, whatever. Uh, hmm. There's something about that. The family of the eight primordials. Okay. The three, the three underlining lines in this hieroglyphic name represent the primary energy in the form of waves. So we could be talking about something for a water sign. Primordial water. So this could be something for um, a water sign. There could be something going back to a water sign. Okay. Horus, stability and equilibrium. I can't make it up. It fell in the reverse. Something is becoming very unstable. Uh, the name Horus could be very significant. The number nine could be very significant. That's for Virgo. Somebody's birthday could be on the ninth of a month. Anubis, transformation in the reverse. I can't make this shit up. Somebody, uh, Anubis, talks about uh, the weighing of the heart. Look at there. Mm-hmm. Anubis is the uh, is is the the guide to the other side. I believe. Alexa, who is Anubis? In the ancient Egyptian religion, the god Anubis is in charge of funerary rites, graves, and the underworld. Mm -hmm. He is typically depicted as a canine or a man with a canine head. Thank you. Good morning, Dwayne. Anytime. Literally, happy Wednesday. That's right, because Anubis prepares, he prepares the bodies to, to, he prepares, he cleanses like it's a cleansing, I believe. Preser preservation, somebody is not going to, the, somebody is not having a safe journey to the other side, okay? Somebody's heart was way heavier than the feather. They didn't pass this test. Somebody didn't pass the test. Anubis, you know, I've read about this before, and forgive me, I'm not an Egyptologist. But Anubis prepares the bodies. He is the undertaker. He's like the mortician. He prepares the bodies to, to cross over. There's something about this here. Completion, completeness in the reverse. I can't make this shit up. 36. Somebody could be age 36. 36 breaks down to a 9 again. We could be talking about a motherfucking Virgo. There's a group though. Completeness. If something was, there was there was something that these people I'm, I'm picking up were hoping went through. Okay. Magic. We got Seth and then Isis. Wow. Right behind each other. This is scary shit. Okay. What's up, baby girl? Good morning. Eighth. Eight. Seth. Resentment. Faith. Uh, faith and wisdom as Isis. Numbers seven and eight. You can have those life path numbers. Or somebody does. This is about somebody's kid. Could be. As we all know the story about um, Seth and Isis tried to kill his mama. Mm -mm. Listen, look at that. Look at look at that. So we have. I'm I'm, I'm really kind of. So what we have here? Somebody. Yeah. Somebody. 
This is about somebody's kid and their parent, possibly. I mean, we can't dismiss this, this set in ISIS energy. I feel like somebody, there's a, there's a reason. So when we talk about magic, we're talking about manipulation. Okay. I feel like, especially when I heard rolled over. So let's look at it like this. Let's say for instance, that your kid, somebody was manipulating your child to do something to you, to take you out. There was a heavy resentment. They built up a resentment with your child. Um, Yeah. Yeah. There's a group of people that were dependent upon a child, your child, quite possibly. Uh, you could be a divine feminine energy. You don't have to be. Um, but whatever, whatever, if you're a male, if you're a male, I'm sorry, my voice cracked there. Somebody could be going through puberty. Somebody could have a child going through puberty right now. This child could be that age. This child could be like 14, 15, somewhere around there, a, a boy or possibly even a girl. But the Isis energy, whether you're male or female, is about faith and wisdom. Somebody who heavily resents you for your faith and wisdom um, used your child or is using your child or was trying to use your child to assassinate that part of you or assassinate you, period. There's a group of people behind this. Okay. Now the, the I know like Khadijah, the mother of believers. Somebody didn't believe some shit. I feel like I feel like right now these people. Uh, I'm spiritually I'm spiritually and financially abundant. I provide heaven and earth for myself. Somebody was trying to ruin that for you. That's the nine of pentacles energy. Somebody was trying to take you out of your nine of pentacles energy. To assassinate you in that way, to take you out that way. I'm picking up on the fact that somebody's very, very, very threatened by your spiritual and financial abundance. You ain't even got to be rich for that. You know what I'm saying? Although financial abundance does say financial abundance. But I'm picking up on that with that nine out here as well. The nine. Nines are very significant. Let's get some energy on this. I don't know. I don't. Um, I know, you know, to have a child, you, you have your child used against you is something I feel. Um, I feel like that should be like a mortal it could possibly be. We all have free will. When people do, when people use children and manipulate them to go against a parent, I feel like you know. Uh, I don't really feel like there is a, a, a cutoff age for when people can you know step into their own free will. I don't believe that. Uh, that's why I believe it's it, it's 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 it carries heavy. There's a heavy weight. So whoever whoever used this child to come against you. Um, fucked up really bad because they you know when we talk about the weighing of the heart this person's heart is heavy as hell from all this manipulation there's a group of people that i feel like that are sitting around feeling some kind of ways plural let's see artificial heart the number 12, we could be talking about a Sagittarius, doesn't have to be. But there's some cycle coming to a close here with three here. A cycle's come to a close. For people that have artificial hearts, for people cold of heart, these people are cold of heart. Your child possibly has turned cold of heart towards you as well. And I'm hearing child specifically. This is somebody's child. Your child has built up a heavy resentment towards you due to manipulation by other people. Possibly um, a brother. This person has had your child gunning for you. You see that? You see that there? Somebody has been teaching your child how to take you, how to take you out, or to take you down.
while your back was turned behind your back that's what I'm picking up these people are this plan was supposed to go through it didn't I'm getting God bumps a lot of them let's see I know she's pregnant you know what I'm saying like I know because she doesn't even karma doesn't even never she never does this she's she's not even really all that affectionate anyway she's just not she's never been yeah that's punky Brewster in there yeah we got Virgo again El El Ermitano El Ermitano La Sacerdotisa, okay? The High Priestess. You could be a High Priestess or a High Priest. Your gifts. Somebody's, you've been looking into something or I don't know. I think somebody went within. I think possibly your kid went within. Clarify the uh, the hermit to the high to the high priestess. Somebody had an, somebody somebody had some type of awakening that occurred within. They went within and then they got in touch. There's a secret. I don't know. Let's see. Sorry, I keep saying I don't know, but you could have gotten some guidance. You could have gotten some guidance, or somebody got some guidance from a high priestess. Yeah, they did. Somebody possibly went to a tarot card reader or some type of spiritualist for some guidance. These people could have, okay, to look into you. They could have. Okay, clarify this energy for me. The letters B and J or J and B are very significant to this download. Thank you. Somebody went behind your back. Somebody's been somebody's been doing a lot of digging into your Akashic record type energy. Somebody's been somebody's been secretly uh, digging up spiritual dirt on you, or to to figure out what makes you vulnerable. Mm -hmm. They have. They've been using your child. I'm telling you, they partnered up with your child. They've been using. I'm picking up on the fact. Okay, so they've been using. They've been using your, they've, they've secretly partnered with your child because your child is an extension of you. There could really be some type of past life energy with you, with you and your child where your child came against you in a previous life and took your ass out. I feel like that's what they found out. That set, this set and, and ISIS energy is very significant. You and your child could be getting along like cats and dogs right now. Not at all. You feel me? They've been using your child. The page of wands. This child, this child, you and your child possibly cannot be speaking to one another right now. But this two of cups here, I'm telling you, in the reverse with the seven of swords, there was a, some type of secret collaboration or secret partnership, some type of agreement that uh, your child has gone into with, with, a, with an adult. With an adult. Some type of adult. Clarify this energy for me. Tell me about this adult. Okay. The lovers in the reverse. Somebody that you used to be with, possibly. Um, some type of soul, toxic soul connection. A Gemini. It could be, they went, I said, tell me about this adult. This is somebody that I feel like, though, is a relative of yours. I'm picking up heavily like on a brother. This brother could be a Gemini. Take the energy as it resonates. Somebody's definitely an air sign. I'm picking up heavy on Gemini, though. 2442, when I look down, that's the truth. That's the truth, Ruth. It's the blank card, okay? Tell us, tell me more, please.
the Ace of Pentacles here to the Nine of Swords. Ace of Pentacles in the reverse to the Nine of Swords. There's some type of loss that, that there's a loss. Okay, so this is like backstory energy probably. Whatever happened, you, there was something that Ace of Pentacles, some type of loss, a huge financial loss. Maybe that you've been trapped or stressed out about. Some type of entrapment, a mental entrapment with the Ace of Pentacles here. The sun in the reverse to the Seven of Pentacles. Here we go with this shit again. A hidden inheritance. Some type of uh, some type of in, some type of in, in, an inheritance. They're using your child to get to access to t your child's the next the next of kin. This these people know that. This could be your family or your friends. I mean, take the energy as it resonates. You know your story better than I. Hold on. Yeah. There was um. They. There's a big. I'm telling you though, this this Ace of Pentacles, to the Nine of Swords, tells me that. You suffered some type of loss. This loss could really just be the loss of your child. In that sense. Not saying that your child passed on. Maybe this child stole something from you. A lot of money from you. Maybe this maybe you're figuring that out. Maybe that's what you've been trapped about. With the son in the reverse. That does talk about things being hidden from you. They used your child to steal something from you. They did. Mm-hmm. You and your child could have possibly had a very, very, very good relationship. And then all of a sudden things change just like that. Mm -hmm. When we talk about resentment, resentment is something that's built up over time. So these people have been working on your child, doing magic on your child, manipulation magic for a very long time. They have been. Especially with the Seven of Pentacles out here that talks about, I mean... If you really want to get to the what I'm hearing right now, it's like from the moment that they knew that you were having a child, they they were they started to work on um, this child to take something from you that you didn't even know that you had, or maybe you did know that you had it. Maybe maybe you well maybe you were well aware of um, this. I don't know. Sagittarius could be very significant. I know. We got the Ace of Wands to the Eight of Cups here. Let's see. You walked away. You walked away. Mm hmm from your child maybe um work Ada. yeah i'm trying to tell you here you uh, i'm picking up on the fact maybe you love from a distance maybe that's what you that's what that's the only thing that you can do i feel like you still take care of this child you still take care of this child you're still financially responsible for this child as you should be. This is your child. You know what I'm saying? But I feel like whatever it is, you you had to walk away. You had to. You had to. To protect yourself from these people. Possibly even your own child, which sucks. You know? You, you worked very hard to give to this child as well, which probably is the reason why you are feeling some kind of way. Or have been. Playing from Dwayne's A15. Betrayal. You walked away after this betrayal. Yeah. Or you're being advised to. I mean, that's up to you, you know. 
You're being advised to. You're being advised to keep to 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 to, to protect yourself. To walk away. I'm not saying walk away from your child. I'm not saying that. I'm saying that you need to walk away to protect yourself from your child. Maybe you've had to do this, or you've been thinking about doing this. This child is not like a little child. This is a this is a teenage child. This is somebody that. Um, I, you know, with that voice cracking earlier, I'm picking up on the fact that this, this is a teenager. Okay. Give me one more. I'm picking up heavily on a brother. Like a brother, a brother has used your, your child. This has been going on for a long time too. The four of Wands, yeah, see? Family, stability, betrayed by, betrayed by people that you um, maybe possibly even lived with or lived around, but betrayal in your household nonetheless with that Four of Wands here in the reverse. It, it ruined it ruined any kind of stability that you had with your people or in your home with your child clarify the three of swords clarify the three of swords Seven of Swords, I'm telling you. Clarify the Seven of Swords. Ten of Wands. That talks to me about cover up. Spirit says that's the truth. Trying to hide the truth. That one to come, what is it? From the Knight of Pentacles, about how you've been being breadcrumbed, or how your child's been being breadcrumbed. I'm trying to see. Listen, the Three of Pentacles here. These people. I'm telling you, these you have people that were around you, breadcrumbing your child. I feel like this Three of Swords talks about you, your child, and these other people. Knight of Pent, the Knight of the Knight of Swords. These people have been working together to hurt you through your child. I'm telling you, with this King of Swords here, the Empress, the Empress, okay, check this out. So we got, you've been blinded to this. You're the Emperor. You're the Emperor. You're the Emperor. That's who they want to hurt. You were blinded to this. Or you have been. You don't, you, know, you shouldn't be now, though. Three, 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 three. Three, 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 three on the clock. Four threes. Twelve again. Sagittarius, Pisces energy. Break down that twelve to a three. Three again. You've been blinded to this. You've been blinded. Like, this whole entire time why, why these people were getting away with something. The six, the six of swords goes to the seven of swords. Okay, these motherfucking people been doing a doing been getting away with this slick shit for far too long. Sorry to say, the Empress card is out here. That could be your mother. That could be your baby's mama. I don't know. And the King of Swords as well could be an uncle. I'm telling you, your brother. This is a brother. I'm, I'm heavily hearing brother. Now this could be your brother and your baby's mama. I would hate to think that your brother and your baby mama are fucking, but it seems like they might be. Whatever they've been doing, they, they work together with your child, with falling under the three of swords, so that you would be vulnerable. So that you would be, so they used your child to weaken you. I'm trying to tell you that they've been trying to weaken you. Bam. Three of, the, the three of cups. These are people that you're, you're I'm telling you. They, they, this, this mother, this empress energy, this is your baby mama or your wife, your ex-wife, 
Y'all could still be married, I'm hearing, but y'all ain't got a divorce. Y'all just don't live together. Then the King of Swords talks about uh, somebody that carries a weapon or some type of public official could be. You could have a family member that is a public official. Or you could have a brother that likes to carry weapons, okay? That has a gun. What I'm hearing. They've been carrying on. Three of Cups. The Three of Swords, the Three of Cups. You can't make this shit up. These people have been carrying on. I told you that you got two people that have been working on your child to take something from you. I feel like your child is, is, has awakened though. Rolled over. Or they will. I do feel like at a certain point that children, our children, because I like to say even if they're grown at a certain point, once, once, once a kid figures out that they've been being used to come against a parent, they flip it. It goes right back. We as children, we do carry resentment towards our parents for a very long time, especially, especially when, when you don't know what people are whispering into your children's ears about you. Um, the lies that they tell, the secrets, that, the lies they tell, the truths they keep. Because children listen, especially to their mothers. Children listen to their mothers a lot. Especially if they're boys. <laughs> they listen to their mother. I feel like I'm picking up on the fact that either a mother or a grandmother, but I'm picking up heavily on a mother. I feel like this mother has blasted you to this child. Has made you has made this child believe that you don't love them, that you don't care about them, that you're selfish. I'm hearing. Florida could be very significant. So there was a divorce. There was a divorce. Four of Wands to the higher font in the reverse. There was a divorce. Yeah, there was a divorce. There was a lot of drama. A lot of fighting over money with this person you got a divorce with and children fighting over kids too. The cycle closed out. You went, you, 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 you took the fool's journey with zero, zero with nothing. You started over. But the fucked up thing is about it is, is that they're still trying to take something from you through your child. Yeah. Your child could be being very selfish. Very selfish right now. To cause, I'm telling you, to, to, to they're, they're, they're using the child. I feel like this child is going to flip the script or if they haven't already on these people, what is this? Yeah, I'm telling you, they're trying to, this is the t the tower in the reverse of the Ten of Pentacles is in the reverse. Now, these people could be experiencing this now. Take the energy as it resonates. Uh, but this marriage or whatever it was, took away, I mean, everything. You didn't have anything. This ch I, feel, I, feel like, I feel like whatever was going on, you, I feel like you decided to stop the fighting for your child's sake. I feel like this this divorce took a very big toll on your child. You saw that, but I but I really kind of feel like what you didn't see is that it's not or what you or what you need to know now, because this could be this could be a prediction, not a prediction, but a, you know I don't like to use the word prediction, but I can I'm telling you really quickly here that what I'm picking up on um, is I don't really feel like this happened yet. I feel like there needs to be a. I picked up on it. Well, I picked. I feel like there's a lot of people going through this kind of thing. There's something that's being hidden from you. Some type of money. I don't know. They're using your child, though. Uh, what? What are we doing here? Hmm. 
They're spying on you too. Gang stalking you or spying. They're spying. I feel like you walked away and um, caught no contact. Okay, we got the, the star here in the reverse. Page of Pen I cannot. The Page of Pentacles to the devil, to the Ten of Cups. Your family again. Your child is about to break free. Your child has. Um, I feel like your child is in this energy. is very unhealed. There's some open wounds. Um, this child here. Is about to is about to break free from this toxic family or is, is about to have an awakening or is about to realize the toxic that something's not right okay that's what i'm picking up i'm picking up on the fact that, that, that this child is about to break free from this toxic family dynamic clarify the uh ten of cups to the devil in the reverse Four of Wands. Yeah, I feel. I feel like. I feel like this. This is just a cycle uh, that had to be completed out. Uh, you know, we all. I was thinking about that this morning, about or last night rather. What did I write? So I, I was sitting here just doing some writing or whatnot, and so check this out. All right. Well. So when we talk about uh, us going, like there's a lesson in everything. Uh, sometimes I don't really feel like there's a lesson for us in everything. I feel like we could be used as variables or tools to be the lesson for someone else. We don't always know how things are going to or why things turn out the way that they do. We always try to make sense of everything. And I don't really feel like that's the point. I feel like the, the point the point that we should really kind of maybe learn sometimes is that maybe we were just there so th we were just a, a, a an extra that we were just an extra um in a storyline for somebody else's lesson sometimes i just feel like that maybe the only lesson that we need to learn is you know sometimes we go well why did i have to go through that why did they do that to me maybe we just needed to learn how something feels for whatever reason Maybe so that we don't treat somebody else that way or maybe so that we can have a better understanding of what a person did. I don't know. I mean, it's going to be different for everybody. But maybe I'm, I'm feeling like because sometimes when, when we think about kids, too, we have to really kind of consider, like, why do we bring kids into the world to carry on, to carry on a part of us? Your kid was supposed to go. I mean, you, this was supposed to happen. I feel like this was supposed to happen. So that your kid could could to bring back some type of stability, but th th there's a this 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 child is over it. I feel like this child is is about to be over this shit. I, you know, the way the way that the way that people uh, convince children to uh, resent their parents, what I feel like happens is that you know sometimes you 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 go, you go back and forth with your kid about the shit, and then at some point you just go, you know what? I can't. What can I do? Especially when a kid is of age. Of, of a sound mind, body, and age. It doesn't have to be an adult. But kids always come back to, to, to a child will always come back to what makes more sense. Once, once they, because a kid, you know, they, they, a child can only be manipulated for so long. They really can. Uh, not all, not, now I'm not saying that, I, I don't believe that that happens to all children, but I do believe that at some point, con, through consistency, You know, I'm telling you, there we go. The King of Swords to the Queen of Wands in the reverse to the Page of Cups. That's who's been working on your child. Three of Swords in the reverse, though. It's coming out because your child's about to see the truth and he's about to go, bye, bitch, which is going to be a major tower for these motherfuckers. They're not going to be able to be protected from this shit either. Nine, the seven of wands to the nine of wands talks about big, big. Um, they're not protected at all. They're not going to be protected because this child's going to have a, a. It's going to go through some type of ascension. Please expect this because they're seeing through the illusions of the bullshit. Okay. Your child's going to. Your child's going to come to their senses. It may take a little bit longer, 
but they're going to come to their senses and be Sagittarius. Again, your child could be a Sagittarius, the Six of Cups. They're going to remember who you are. They're going to remember they're going to remember who you are, despite of the fact that you're that whoever's been telling them that you're some type of karmic emperor, like some, some fucked up dad. Yeah. This child's going to remember they're going to remember who you are with the six of cups here. This child could be smoking a lot of damn weed, too. OK, your child could smoke a lot of weed. You could, too. This child smokes a lot of weed, though. I feel like I feel like whoever the mother is lets them do whatever the fuck they want to do, which is probably the reason why they are so kind of, you know, because this mother I'm picking up on is uh, you see the picture, the picture, the broken picture in the back. Yeah, this 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 mother is kind of fucked up. This mother is karmic as fuck. This mother allows their child to do whatever the fuck they want to do. This mother is more they friend. Want to be they friend and shit. And that's the biggest motherfucking mistake when you're dealing with younger children, teenage children. Don't be their motherfucking friend. I mean, be friendly with them. You know, I, I made that mistake with my kid, you know, trying to be his friend because I had, you know, for years of, you know, making up for stuff. And that went sideways. OK, you can be you can you can your, your, your kids should trust you and love you like they you know, they could come to you. They should be your best friend type shit. But at the end of the day, you still got to be their parent. I don't feel like this mother's being a parent. I feel like this mother's just being their friend, being their best friend, doing whatever. You know, this is the fun parent. But it's only but the, but but it's 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 hurting the child worse. But they but they're only using this child as a pawn. My nose is itching like a motherfucker. G. This mother this mother lets this kid do whatever they want to do just because this mother wants to gain access to what's left for you. However that works. Next to Ken, I heard next to Ken, they could be trying to take your ass out. Or could something have been left for your child? Hello, one second. I just heard that. Something could have been left for your child. Possibly by, um, so what is going on here? King of Wands, Five of Pentacles to the Death Card in the reverse. These people, so they done took everything from your, your ass through the divorce. So let's say that. Let's just say this. Somebody took everything from you through a divorce. Okay? Everything. Okay? Took everything. They took everything. And that's not enough. There was something left for your child. Come through spirit. There's something left for your child. They want access to that. So possibly from like a grandparent, you're one of your parents. Yeah, it had to be. It had to be. Something left like a trust fund for your child. And that's the reason why this mother figure and your brother are manipulating your child to get you out of the way. They already took everything from you, but now they want to get your ass out of the way so that they can have access to the money from this child. That's why this person is being this child's best friend. This is the reason why they want you out of the way because you already, maybe you, I mean, you got to know about it. You got to know about it. You Maybe you don't, but I'm telling you that they know about it. I feel like you've been caught, so caught up in what's been going on uh, with you with you in this divorce or this or this breakup but, but i feel like you don't you're not even considering like that's what they're doing this for final message 10 44 a.m 4 4 i'm telling you this is a truth loop. ten of cups in the reverse to the ten of swords in the reverse King of Pentacles in the reverse. What else? The hangman. They about to be stuck. I'm telling you, your kids are gonna wake up and then they're gonna be stuck. This toxic family dynamic is trying to is trying to make sure that they that their that their finances, whatever. Ten of Pentacles, the King of Pentacles here. They don't want an ending to this I heard money train. 
they're about to be stuck or this kid your kids about to be enlightened page of pentacles yeah if this kid's about to be enlightened this kid's about to wake up and realize something i don't know when because they are being blind they're being used by the queen of cups by his mother mother their mother has them blinded to seven of pentacles in the reverse to take from this inheritance trust fund whatever not to say it like this but your kids worth a lot of money you know what i'm saying to this to this mother figure i feel like i feel like this mother figure this child was worth a lot of money to her when y'all were together and even now but i feel like they're, they're just they just want access to what's been left for your child let me get you out of um fuck it let's get an archangel michael um oracle card out here Go forward fearlessly from Archangel Michael. This is the prayer. Thank you for walking with me every step of the way, for holding my hand, giving me confidence and courage and guiding my thoughts and actions in the direction of love and my true life's purpose. That is the Archangel Michael prayer for you, whoever this message resonates with. I'm closing out the message. Uh, make sure you like, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell, select the all options so that I, so that you know when all my uploads upload. You feel me? I'm your uncle, 790 Spiritual Savage. Remember, you grow, I grow, I grow, you grow, we grow together. It's always love and light around this bitch. It's always take it easy. I love you to the moon and back. Deuces. Savage.